Hello and welcome to the show. We are here today on BeamNG Drive with some more Mario Kart circuits. Uh, Amy and uh, Rossi have been busy uh, making these tracks. Well, Amy has ported some Mario Kart 8 circuits. I vaguely recognise, I don't know the name of this one, I vaguely recognise this track. Uh, if you recognise this circuit, you will know. Yeah, we've got anti-gravity stuff to deal with here. And it does work, which is amazing. Uh, <laughs> it's absolutely fantastic uh, that we have got some anti-gravity stuff working. Now, it does mean for this six-lap race, I am going to have to be driving from Bonnet View. It's very difficult with the way... Well, the, the orbital camera that I normally drive with, uh, you can't really use for the... Uh, oh, God. For the hill bit, uh, because it will get a bit stuck and you spend more time faffing about the camera than you do actually driving. Uh, the chase camera is fixed so solidly to the back of the car it judders around and gives me a headache. So we're having to drive from bonnet camera. It's our best chance of actually being able to see where we're going when we get to this bit. But yes, this is... Oh dear, I've done exactly the same thing that Lombo has done. Uh, we are on the grass. Uh, it's quite a, quite a curve to get on the grass. But yeah, the anti-gravity actually works in beam. The cars are stuck on the road. It's fantastic. Very, very cool. Uh, we are running down... Oh god, downhill. And I am not stopping for the final corner. I think me and Lombo have both broken our car. And we're both going to do the same thing. Uh, we are both going to do the reset job. Because, uh, <laughs> you know... <laughs> we might as well. Uh, yeah, we just ran... We ran wide. Once you damage your car like this, it's, it's just kind of game over, really. Uh, unfortunately. But that is how it goes. We do have Slipstream turned on as well, in a hope of getting some... I say closer racing. It's a little bumpy through this section. You've got to be careful. The car can get quite upset through there. Oh, and then you end up doing that. Uh, don't stall. Power, power, power out of it. We are okay. I think Shadow and potentially Amy have had issues through there. Uh, I just... That was a panic and boot it and hope. Speedy seems to have fallen down through a place they should not have been able to fall down through. That's honestly quite impressive. Uh, I don't know how you've managed to get there. Uh, but you're there. Stevie's had to take a trip to the pits. It now becomes a case of can I catch Longbow uh, for potentially a podium spot in this one. I'm going to go with probably not. Uh, but you never know. Uh, will we... So, Gliska... I don't think leads. Danger Man second. Uh, maybe, or maybe there's someone out in front of them, honestly. I, I don't think so. I don't think so. Right, less bumping. More control up here. I mean, the, the very sideways line was probably looked cool, but it wasn't very effective. Now, I do have the radar on. Oh! Stevie got to the inside and gave us a bit of assistance. Uh, as I say, I've got the radar on. It's not the most accurate going up over the loop, funnily enough. Uh, it has some issues with that one. Oh no, something's broken in my car. Uh, yeah, I'm going to guess Stevie bent a wheel or something in that contact. Uh, Shadow's gone wide of the jump. Uh, yeah, if I go on the brakes and the car rotates, something's gone wrong, basically. Uh, <laughs> right, let's desperately try to slow down for turn one. Uh, okay, fourth place now looks like a distant... A distant hope. You never know what's going to happen. Uh, I think I was a little, I was perhaps a little bit slower through the hairpin than I needed to be. Oh god. Uh, that's a bit wide. That is a little bit wide for us. Come on. <laughs> so we've got the chariot. Oh god. The, this is like the hill climb one. It's a very fast race car, this thing essentially. So I'm going to go earlier on the brakes. Oh, it has got a little bit upset on its own. Down there. Don't hit that ramp. Uh, so the boost pads on this circuit do work uh, around the place, which is a cool option. However, they're not very powerful because, well, this is beam. Uh, and if you hit a boost pad like that, you are just getting, just going very quickly into a wall, basically. So it's actually not that much quicker to use them, particularly. Uh, so I'm not really that fussed. And I mean, the jump at the end, you know, you're going to break your car on, the, on that final one. So, oh, okay, so we're on to the final lap for them. I've had a bit of a bad lap, which is a shame. Got to be a bit careful of Shadow. Not 100% sure how, quite how far back they actually are on the radar. Relatively close uh, behind. More likely to come under threat from them. I don't quite know why I've been having so much issues 
with my car down here. I might be moving a little bit too much under braking, and that's what's been causing issues for it. Uh, shadows run wide there and got themselves into trouble. Uh, we are... I've been, I was finding uh, testing slow into that first quarter, quick out of that first quarter, was the way to go, uh, which I should probably have been doing more of. Uh, we are not... Uh, oh, Longbow has lost some time, which makes me wonder if Longbow may have broken the car. You can't reset the car on this anti-gravity bit. The game gets very confused, which is understandable, because it's not really intended. I mean, what we are doing to poor Beam at the moment is incredible, uh, but it's not really intended to deal with anti-gravity. Uh, it looks like Gliska won, Danger Man is second, Longbow is going to cross the line in third. Uh, we are going to round the final corner. Ugh. And there we go. Oh, that was Longbow, not Stevie. <laughs> I was meant to crash into Stevie, and I got the wrong car. Oh, there we go. Hey, look, Longbow, your car's fine. I don't know what you're talking about. Everything's fine. My car's surprisingly okay from that. Uh, yeah, it didn't really go very well to plan, that race. A couple of bumps early on. Um, yeah. Kind of only really figured out, I only really got into a groove towards the end. It started off poorly, uh, then <laughs> continued poorly, found a little bit of a groove here. Awesome, awesome circuit. Absolutely fantastic circuit, though. Um, yeah, able to do anti-gravity and beam is very cool indeed. For our next race, we have come to the snow. Yep, we have got a snow circuit. We're stop... kind of. The main sort of bit of the track is essentially a wet tarmac in terms of grip, but this corner here is very slippery ice. There's pretty much no grip over here to deal with, which is going to be an interesting one to kind of make the most of. We are driving some all-wheel drive. This is the Kashira, an all-wheel drive rally spec of this. And they're pretty, they're pretty resilient to bumps and shunts. They're pretty quick. They've got, you know, the tires to deal with the environment at least as as best as possible uh we've got the tires to deal with it apparently the chat box didn't want to work well we've got the hazards on uh i think we're going i don't know what button is the hazards so i think we're going for an entire race with them on now uh right what could go wrong with this we are off and underway there is a red car to the inside so there's not a huge amount of grip uh, for the turn in through this section uh oh i'm in the wrong gear slightly. Oh, Speed Beast has climbed a snowbank and got into a world of trouble. Uh, but we are through. Now, this next corner here, you're going to see me do something I would not normally do, but uh, it's actually a corner that is quicker to go through very sideways, which is what we are going to do. We're going to double overtake, and we are to the lead of the race. Now, we're onto the ice. And as I said, there is no grip here. I have not turned in soon enough. Uh, so we are just going to understeer our way into this one. We'll bump the banking. Amy's about to slide into us. Uh, Danger Man had kind of the right idea. So I don't mind running out wide through there. I got the turning point wrong. Well, I, I got my... I completely messed up that corner. Uh, so I don't mind the running out very wide and get a much straighter exit. I can get on the power sooner uh, than Danger Man could, which means I'll carry more speed up this steep hill. But it was... Yeah, it was a little bit... Uh, messed up with other cars. We are to the outside of Danger Man. A little bit of contact, that's not too bad. The Kashira is pretty strong. It'll survive contact like that. I'm not going to do anything stupid down here uh, through this section. Danger Man is on a funky line and is about to go hit the snowbank. Uh, we are going for a shuck it and hope into the final corner. Uh, Danger Man is back alongside, but we will come out the other side with the lead of the race. We will lead lap one, but I think I'm going a little bit too fast into turn number one. Uh, oh. Yeah, we are, although Danger Man's about to get stuck behind us. Uh, that's okay. We'll get away with that. We will essentially just defend the inside. Don't mind getting a bit sideways on the exit there. Danger Man is to the inside now. We are going very sideways. There are two very different approaches to that corner between me and Danger Man, and we have got... <laughs> I love, it's the only corner I've ever come across where I can literally be at a 90 degree angle different to Danger Man and it works. Oh, that's too far wide for me. That was too much uh, out wide. Uh, we are going to, I mean, we actually, well, oh God, we slightly cheesed it, not quite how I wanted to cheese it because we bumped up on the exit. So there is technically like some ground you can drive on on the outside of that corner. We're not allowed to intentionally run around there because that would be cheating and boring. Uh, but we got some traction there. I'm in the wrong gear. I should have been in third for that section. Um, 
they have not really made the most of it. Danger Man is back up the inside again. Well, we saw what happened last time. If you get your turning point wrong through here, uh, Danger Man ended up in all sorts of trouble, and this time it is better uh, for them. They've got massive understeer, though, heading towards the final corner. We are on a much better line through there. Might be able to put the power down. It's a run towards the line, and we are across this one onto the start of lap number three. Danger Man is looking to the outside through there. He's going to be slow mid-corner, I think. We're still on the inside. <laughs> oh, we are to the lead of the race once more. That red car may well be back up the inside again uh, on the exit. It is not quite. Right, time to go backwards again through this corner. It's fine. We are out the other side. Right, break, 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 break. Now we are on... Oh, we're, on a, we're on a bit of a wonky line where I don't really want to be. Uh, I'm actually okay with getting very sideways here. Danger Man is going... So Danger Man does actually intentionally take a very different line to me, which I'm fine with because it's going to get past. The hope is uh, I can get a better run here if I get my gearing right. Not It's not as good as I wanted it to be uh, through there. Danger Man is back into the lead of the race. Can we? We're on a... Whoa! We're on a tight line through there. It's a little bit of a tag. Danger Man will survive that one, though. We have lost a little bit of ground through here, although I'm much better through this section this time around. Danger Man is out wide. We are trying to get to the inside. Uh, carefully does it. We're both neat and tidy. I've got on the power a little bit too soon. Oh, ho, ho. That was millimetres away from disaster there. Oh, that is disaster for us. I think we'll survive it just. It's an only just survive. I've played that one so risky. We are on the borderline of disaster throughout that corner, but we got away with it. Uh, right. Backwards we go again. Try and maybe make up some time. Oh, stalled it a little bit, which is not what we wanted. Uh, now, can we... Oh, Danger Man is going, got this one wrong. Danger Man has got this one quite, quite badly wrong. I mean, we're, we're both going to struggle for the traction here. Oh, come on. Come on, Kashira, find some drive here. Uh, we are on the slightly preferred line for the run here. Uh, once again, it's going to be very, very close. There's another lap where it's going to be a mad battle to the finish line. I think, this is, well, this is the penultimate lap. We're not going to find a way past here. We carry good speed through that section, though. We are understeering a little bit on the exit. Not great. I think it's a little I think a little slower on the way through here. It's not the worst idea in the world. Just kind of gather it all up for the final corner. Uh, we've both got a similar line through there. Similar amount of understeer. Wheel spin. Oh, sliding from both of us. This is the final lap of the race. This has been an absolutely astonishing battle through here. We are neater through this first section. Danger Man just a little bit out of line. Oh, we got a little bit closer through there than I was meaning to. <laughs> no one is bothering us from behind. We know Danger Man is going to take the different approach through this corner than we do. Oh, Danger Man is going to fight back on the inside. But we know we're vastly different through that corner. It's the one corner where we are. Well, we're a little, quite a bit different here as well. Uh, again, intentionally different, I should point out. I don't mind this line here. Well, I might have liked to have got it a little bit tighter to the apex. or well, to the apex, but a little bit tighter through there. Uh, come on. Find that traction. Get that launch. No, we're a bit further back than I wanted to be. Danger Man's done that really well this time around. Uh, I'm leaving it in third. My hope is... I mean, it's going to spin the wheels like crazy. My hope is to get a good run up here. It's better. It's not perfect, mind you, but it is better. I think... Well, Danger Man's got it, barring a mistake through here, which is possible... I mean, there's one other thing that I can do, and I will do. Uh, we are going to go... Oh, no, 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 no. I've got it wrong through here. No. I was going to go for full send it into this corner, but I actually got it wrong on the approach, uh, which is a shame. I'm not going to find out whether we could have done it. Danger Man will take a victory in this one. Well done. Great race. Absolutely fantastic race right there. Uh, <laughs> that was a lot of fun. I was, I'm annoyed at myself. I'm so annoyed at myself because if I'd backed it off, I just went too fast into that final stretch because I was going to just rip the handbrake and see what I could do in the final corner. And I feel like we could have done it. I feel like we could have done it. But, yeah, silly error. Silly error by me. Um, it was... Uh, <laughs> 
awesome fun. I, I absolutely love this track. Uh, fantastic. Fantastic racing throughout the whole thing. Um, yeah. There we go. Uh, apparently Amy cheated. Oh, dear. <laughs> oh, dear. Well, we had an absolutely fantastic race up at the front. The next races are going to have a tough time to beat that one, i got to say. We are off to the desert for our next race, and we have got vans. Uh, this is the uh, H-Series, the off-road vanster. Uh, 400 on horsepower, it's quite heavy. The only thing with this circuit, of course, is well, the actual one would have water, but we can't really do that uh, in here, so that's just been got rid of. Uh, it could be quite an interesting race, this circuit. It's a little bit more straightforward than slipping around on the ice. Could be quite close. Uh, we have had to whack the slipstream up a fair bit to try... Uh, in the hope of getting a more exciting race, basically. Uh, we will get everybody ready. It's a four-lap race, relatively long laps around here. Uh, we will see what we can do. We are off and underway. Stevie's had a slow start from pole position. That's kind of screwed me a little bit, but never mind. Uh, we are underway. Uh, so this section here, when you are back in the pack, is very difficult to see where track limits are. We are going to try and not cut the circuit. However, you can't see for dust and vehicles, so there may be some interesting interpretations of track limits. Oh god, or there may be some frantically trying to avoid Amy and Danger Man having an accident. That is also a distinct possibility. We have made it through. We are out the other side. We are in one piece. Oh, Longbow's up onto two wheels. Uh, there are a few places where these vehicles might just suddenly lose a wheel uh, with some of the jumps. This section here, you can be... It's up to you how aggressive you try and jump into the whirlpool. You can be very aggressive and try and make up some time. It can work, but you know, the bigger the jump, the more likely you are to damage your vehicle. You want to stick really to the left here if you don't want to break your car. Oh, Amy wanted to make us go very fast. Oh, we've got over. We've got over. We've wiped Amy out. Oh, we're going to be broken. Uh, we have... <laughs> I'm going to go and have a reset on that one. Um... We got very, we got brutally murdered. Uh, oh, Stevie is also going for uh, well, it's a lap, to, it's a start of lap two. Oh, we that was a hell of a wreck. That was a hell of a, a hell of a push. We are probably going to be a little bit more uh, interpretive in our track limits down here. <laughs> <laughs> as a catch-up. Oh, someone's had a tremendous flip. It's that Longbow. Longbow may have got over on their own through that section. Not sure. But that wasn't even me trying to... That one wasn't me trying to cut the corner. I genuinely didn't see where it was. And guess worked. And guessed a little bit too much on the inside. Uh, oh. Uh, <laughs> uh, we cheated a little bit. I got very brutally murdered. I think it's fair. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, no. Oh, not again. Uh, <laughs> just, oh, Glisk has fallen over in front as well. <laughs> it's gone really badly wrong. You know, we do a test race on these just to see how it's going to work and make sure that nothing's going to go funky or whatever. The test race, 10 times cleaner than this one. The second we start filming, it's all gone horribly, horribly wrong. But never mind, we don't slide through the final corner. Uh, it looks like it is Shadow and Speed Beast that are leading the way. Danger Man hit the pillar, Longbow fell over. I've been murdered and involved in everyone else's crashes. Uh, Amy's been involved in crashes. Stevie was also involved in crashes at the start. Um, yeah, it's been very scruffy, but we've got a couple of laps. Can we recover in this couple of laps? Uh, now, I'm gonna try, oh. Well, we're going to help Amy through the corner. Uh, oh, no, nope, I'm out of shape. You get out of shape a little bit through there. It's very difficult to recover. It. Danger Man is right behind us. Uh, Gliska, oh, so Gliska, Gliska fell over. I presume they fell over on their own because they were in front of us at the point where they had to reset. Uh, but there we go. Right, how aggressive do we go jumping down here? Not as aggressive as I have been. Uh, Stevie with an awkward bounce. We get a good a good run through there, actually. This time around, it's, it's quite good. Uh, Stevie may be in trouble here. I'm having a bit of a lift because I don't know where the purple vehicle is going to end up. Uh, across the nose, we're going to do to Stevie what Amy did to us, essentially. Although I think, I think Stevie's gone for a massive roll this time around. Uh, Longbow's vehicle is understeering a bit like mine. Oh, Longbow took damage. Uh, final lap of the race. We almost fell over. I had to 
frantically try and grab my vehicle and, and steer it away from a massive accident. So it's going to come down to Speed Beast versus Shadow at the front, and then there's a big group of cars potentially battling over third position. If I can get a good run through here and Amy makes any mistakes, there's a chance for us here. Uh... Oh, I can hear supercharger whine all around. I'm up onto two wheels. There's Longbow and Gliska back there. Uh, is there anyone to the inside? I hope not. Don't think so. Uh, we are going to... Oh, we're all pushing it on the exit through there. How brave dare you be down here. Gliska's jumped a little bit more inside. Uh, I think we've got a better run through there, though. We've definitely got a better run through there than maybe... maybe the slipstream is going to kick in now would be the time to do it uh we've got a lot of speed heading towards this final section can we send it here uh it's going to be a big jump we're going to go to the outside it's going to be side by side through there i think third gear is going to be the way to go shadow is second speed beast takes victory we are going to steal a podium at the end oh <laughs> And Amy has fallen over. Danger Man visited a different pillar. Danger Man has visited the scenery in that one. Whew. That, I'm pleased with that pass. Uh, Amy, you cannot say very rude after what you did to me on the first lap. <laughs> you do not get to say very rude after the brutal murder on lap one. Uh, Stevie is a bastard. Where is Stevie? Uh, oh, there, there is Stevie. Stevie lost a wheel. That could well be some desync. But uh, there we go. Oh, dear. Good, good fun. Good race. We were never quite in the battle for the front. That being said, we had an excellent, very silly battle over the podium positions. I'll, at the end of the day, yeah, you know what? I'll take a third. After the awful start, I will absolutely take a third. Four. Our final race, we have got something very wacky and very trippy. And I mean, you get the idea here. Uh, in fact, we're going to be racing up there at some point. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's madness. It's very cool. It's very cool. I can't say I particularly remember this track. But we are going to be racing on beam around here. There are many concerns. There are a lot of potential for things to go wrong. And there's a lot of fingers crossed things don't go wrong. But we're going to sort of deal with them as and when they come up. Because uh, resetting around here is uh, going to be difficult. It is safe to say. But we are going to give it a try. We are racing the D15. This is the off-road D series. Uh, but it's, we're racing it as rear-wheel drive. We're still on the off-road tyres. I did not get a great start on that one. Uh, which is not particularly what we want. Uh, you know what? I'm fine, honestly, to just be a little bit cautious on this opening lap. Uh, it's not a huge amount of grip. You can sort of steer with the rear if you're careful. Thought Gliska did a bit too much steering with the rear there. Uh, yeah, you can you can kind of slide it a little bit. Um, Apollo agrees with that statement. This is where it gets really trippy because, I mean, we are basically vertically heading down towards the ground, but the track's actually fine it's so weird it's so weird driving on a game like this beam where we're so used to ultra realism and i mean the physics of course are still ultra real it's just gravity uh, it's yeah remarkable that this stuff is actually possible here it's really very very cool and then there's this bit here oh, where it kind of twists uh yeah it's it's fantastically well done uh to have all of this behave itself uh, Danger Man is leading the way from Longbow, followed by Stevie and Amy. Stevie may be about to be in trouble. Now, this section here, we cannot go quick over. Uh, oh, I mean, that was actually a little bit fast. I am going a bit quicker than I think the cars ahead, trying to make up time. Oh, um, yes, yeah, so we've got to be on bonnet view, otherwise the camera just doesn't know what to do. Uh, so I apologise a little bit, uh, but it's just what it is. Um, and resetting is super difficult. So what we, we've got a kind of a rule whereby if you get stuck somewhere along the way, uh, you are allowed to... So you can't reset while the cars are in anti-gravity, which is basically all of this track, because the cars won't reset properly. So you are allowed to sort of teleport yourself to the grid, F7, wait for the train to go past, and then join back in. It, otherwise, yeah, it does. You just can never get back into the into the race. So to make it more, to make it fair, and make it a bit more interesting for everyone, we are allowing that. Uh, 
Deja Man is leading from Longbow. Amy is third. I am being a little bit cautious. Oh, our lap counter is gone. Well, that's done. <laughs> we have to keep track of ourselves. Laps ourselves this time. Oh, I've overdone it. Uh, I have got too much wheel spin, and that is going to put Shadow past. Might get a good exit here and be able to fight back, but oh, I don't know. Don't know if I want to be doing that. I am playing this a little bit cautious at the moment. Uh, Amy's up to second, past Longbow. Uh, De 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 not a million miles away. It's surprisingly close between everybody here. Uh, how brave dare you be over this section? Oh, it's super sketchy, really, because uh, no, one, no one wants to be the one that breaks their vehicle. I want to make up time, but we've got to be careful. Uh, this corner here, just the... Oh god, the physics of it are so surreal and confusing almost while we're trying to figure out... Oh, Shadow dove all the way down to the bottom uh, and has kind of made that one work uh, a little bit or has ended up out wide. Gliska's got past. Longbow's disintegrated and broken bits on the way through there, I think, although I think that may be a little bit of desync. Uh, Amy is up to the front. Danger Man's had a not-so-good lap. Uh, we are barreling into this corner relatively quickly. Oh, my turn to get a big kick of oversteer. Uh, the radar is almost useless on this track because everything's spinning around at funky angles and, yeah. Oh, I don't know if Longbow would have known there was a vehicle alongside. Oh, there's a Stevie. I don't quite know how a Stevie's there. Oh, contact in front. We are around the outside of that. Uh, <laughs> we're up to third. We've got Shadow behind now. No more shenanigans. The vehicle... Ah, oh, Stevie was... I think Stevie's vehicle teleporting around may well have given Longbow and Gliska issues there. Uh, the, the way the whole, like, anti-gravity works... Oh, crap. The vehicles do handle strange. They definitely aren't right uh, in the handling department. Gliska's on the inside. The map saying they're on the other side, which is not very helpful. That, that, you know, there we go. I don't know where they are. They're still on that outside. They ran a little bit wide. Oh, that might be a bit too quick. No, we're fine. I mean, this vehicle is quite strong. It'll get away with some bumps. Ooh. Okay, maybe that was a bit too big of a bump. But, you know, it's fine. Uh, slight issue. My bonnet is starting to come up. Uh, that would be a... That could be a real problem if that... I'm going to have to be a bit careful on the uh, final lap here. We're not a million miles away if the leaders get into trouble. And Amy's vehicle is smoking quite heavily. Uh, that could help. Oh, Amy's, Amy's had a spin, I think. Oh, we then almost had a spin. Uh, as I tried to get on the throttle too quickly. Uh, in, I say, preparation. Uh, yeah, we are onto the final lap. Danger Man's checked out a little bit at the front. Uh, I'm not... I'm not as good at this circuit with this car as some of the, some of the other circuits that we have been to today. Uh, will we be able to do anything about the pink machine ahead? A uh, bit of a slide. Will Gliska be able to catch us? That is the other concern, of course. Oh, I've had a good exit through there. Uh, oh, get that transition. Amy's in trouble. I think Amy may have got some damage somewhere. Uh, as that vehicle was challenging for the lead and has now slipped, has slipped back, slipped off of the podium as well. Danger Man will be playing it safe. Will Gliska send it down here? Oh, I'm sliding all over the place. Yeah, will Gliska send it to try and make up the position? Will Gliska break the vehicle doing it? I mean, they've got to the inside here. Oh, I'm over the crest there in trouble. Don't know where Gliska is. Can't see. Oh, Gliska's dove all the way to the bottom, and that's going to be the way to do it. That's the line to take there. Christ. Couldn't see where they were, but uh, fair enough. I think they were just quicker than me around here. And we will cross the line. It's a podium. I will take the podium. I have a feeling... I have a feeling Amy broke something on the last lap. Danger Man with a victory. Well done, Danger Man, on that one. Christ, it's such... <laughs> it's, it's, it's so wacky that that works in Beam. Holy crap. It's awesome. Uh, very difficult. Christ, it is tough to drive around. Uh, these vehicles yeah, did not particularly suit me, personally. But uh, very, very cool that, that, that it's a track that we can, we can race and we can make work on Beam. But... Uh, there we go. That is going to be it for this for this video. Thank you all very much for watching. A very big thank you to Amy and to Rossi for their work on 
On these, Amy Porting it, Rossi helping with the sort of scripting, getting the upside down driving and all that working. If you do want to have a go with these maps, um, you will have to get onto Amy's Discord if you want to get them. There'll be a link to that in the description. So you can download these, have a go with them yourselves. That, though, is going to be it from me. Until next time, uh, yeah, goodbye.